white. The white. The white. The radio station with more. You're listening to the radio station. You're listening to. You're listening to. This is Radio Pia. Radio Pia. The radio station with more. You're listening to the radio station. You're listening to. You're listening to. This is Radio Pia. Radio Pia. Mommy, mommy, don't cry. Daddy. Set for freedom, yeah. Take my life, but you can never take away that joy. Freedom is ours. We got what it takes to live. Hello, Piafra. Hello, Piafra. Now we be the Piafra. Hello, Piafra. Hello, Piafra. Hello, Piafra. Hello, Piafra. Hello, Piafra. Hello, Piafra. Freedom is yeah. Once again, fellow Biafrans, lovers of freedom, men and women of goodwill, conscious people, wherever you are all over the world, 
I say good morning, good afternoon, good evening, and to some of you, good night, depending on your time zone. This is Radio Biafra Extra, and we are streaming live to Radio Biafra London. Radio Biafra London is being anchored by the deputy leader of the indigenous people of Biafra. His name is Maze Uche Ukafo Mefo. Maze Uche Ukafo Mefo is from Abatiti. Abatiti is in Anambra State. And Anambra State is Biafra land. He is the man who have assured us that he will not allow the heart of this project to see corruption. Like I always said, I do not expect you to understand the mindset behind those words, but one day you shall. He is standing in a deputizing capacity on behalf of our Supreme Leader, Mazenande Ukukano, the King of Afari Beku, the one and the only man who stood up to speak for the collective interest of the Biafran people for almost 60 years now. And by the grace of Chuku Kikabiyama, I remain George Unibe, I come from Abo, Abo is in Delta State, and Delta State is Biafra land. And of course, without wasting much of our time, I must move ahead to acknowledge the Almighty Creator. Chuku Kika Biyama, Obanke Tuku Junwa No Ya, Omakai Se Biowa. The one who is our guide, a hope and stay, a matter both great and small, he remains the primordial influence that drives us in everything we'll do. Oge meme boge umu chuku jangunyo. Oge meme boge umu chuku jangunyo. Ekwen swa bata, oba gara bata o. Onye ni meme me, ya po chuku kika biya mako biya o. Oge meme boge o, omo biya fraji ngwangunyo. Oge meme boge omo chuku jangunyo. Emanandiru abata, oba gara abata o. Onye ni meme me o, ya po chine kiko biya o. Anye na jage mau, ni hina imaramaye, inhuna nyaye ni nage ubi omage, ujuru anyanya dadyo, ingwe gimbangwe u, odi unye dekage, ebu wafano omega, anye nini nasena, nede mau, isi, isi, isi. And of course, at this very moment, I welcome everybody once again to this evening segment. Of course, on this segment, the team remain back to your root. Back to your root. We have been battling with this issue, but believe me, you will get used to it. We don't seek people's approval because it will not take us anywhere. We want to do the right thing. And in the end, let the next generation bear testament to the fact that even in our weakest stage, we are stronger than those who claim to be strong. Like I said this evening, our team remain back to your root. I came ac across a post this evening online. And the person said, I just remembered what my teacher used to do to me in school. He said, my teacher will flog me for speaking my dialect, my language, my mother tongue. They will flog me and said, why are you speaking vernacular? They will flog you very well. And the young man said, if we have told that teacher that the brain is damaged, that time they won't believe. And it, it did happen to me. In the class like this, we will hide. And I will speak up for my brother. We're here, we're here, we're here. The next thing I will hear, teacher will flog me. Bam! Why are you speaking vernacular? Why am I speaking Abo? My own teacher flogged me. All of us have our own share of brain damage. Nigerian damage our brain. So if we come, we tell you you are idiot. I want you to look at the reality. It's not that it's the best way. Your brain is damaged. All of us have our share of brain damage. Because of the Nigerian factor, you can reject it today. Your children will mock you tomorrow. I'm telling you, giving you light example. Teacher will flog you. Bam! You will, sometimes you will fall on the floor and you crawl. 
the tea dancing you hear the teacher will say why are you speaking vernacular as if you have killed somebody today we are telling everybody this is the truth this is the truth everybody is trying to protest self-interest oh some people now will be saying oh it's a government they want to worship evil but let me try and be a gentleman you will get it but today now if i have met with one of those teachers who did that thing to me i wonder how they will look at me i will call the person and say so now you they flog me sir the speaker boy okay john odomi but today we understand that your language is your power but then our ancestors was telling us that Ayonia won't want, your language is your power today we, you are seeing the truth but you you will not agree your brain has been damaged until you have damaged everything then that is when you will understand we are here to fight for biafra to be restored not to rebuild one nigeria and whatever everybody is doing if the target is not to get one pure biafra like a bride appearing before the throne of chuko kikabiyama for all of us to enjoy get ready the journey has just begun i always say it our leader mazen nandekano have put something in place he can't even stop it the earlier we tell ourselves the better the truth the better for all of us but of course our team being back to your root our topic this evening is simply titled some of the mysterious culture and tradition of our ancestors that we need to pay attention to there are cultures and traditions being observed by our ancestors. They were for a purpose, but we demonize this. The same way we were flogged in school for speaking our own language, our own mother tongue, our own teacher from our village will flog us. How dare you speak Abo? The same way we are the one condemning our culture, things you know nothing about. What you don't know is bigger than you. You you eager when you pass this junction, there is another junction there. That is where we see people planning. You are planning, you are doing coup. Who are you doing coup for? Who are you doing coup for? Understand everything they did served a purpose. And if we don't make use of it, the journey is a very long one. Our topic, I repeat again, is some of the mysterious culture and tradition of our ancestors that we need to pay attention to this is the part one there are a lot of practices about our ancestors that we truly don't understand the mindset behind them so many there are so many things our father they do these things every day but we don't know why they do that they are mystical in nature and have been condemned by the imperialist we ignorantly run away from them considering them to be fetish or demonic a lot of our culture and tradition if you put it if you try and exhibit them put them into practice the imperialist told you the evil please forget about it no 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 you, you can't do that it's fetish who told you they are mystical they say many things these things will help us one day because these things are the things that are doing us if i tell you that yoruba is doing juju for all of you you will not agree they call it Ikbelonoma. yoruba is doing juju call it Ikbelonoma for all of you were you shocked when our leader said there is a fulani native doctor in enugu was i the one that says so but Yoruba pastors are destroying all the Shiran. Oh, it's evil, it's evil. But the full uh, 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 Shiran in Enugu, Yoruba pastors are not destroying it. It's as simple as that. Hey, it's mystical. It don't go there. <laughs> Man, fear that which they cannot understand. That is the beginning of the undoing of everybody. When you want to fight community, you send quarry and confusion for them. Everybody is quarreling. Who are you fighting? Who are you fighting for? We call that juju. Igbe lo noma. Igbe lo noma. 
they will just do it alone and the money they blow it for you but if i tell you what you will do and send it back to the sender he said no it's fetish my yoruba pastor said don't do it and we are fighting for biafra are you not surprised that the high priest of abeno Pabi of enugu state is a full animal did our leader not show you the video and you are telling me that fool and man who want to take your land by law, by poisoning you, by killing you, by destroying you, is there to bless any good people? Why can't we tell ourselves the truth once and for all? Because, because by the time we begin to look into some of these things, somebody say, oh, this guy is going to a government. He got a fool or God when so, when the time come. Things are wrong. And if you don't accept that truth and embrace that truth, you will see that it, when you some people will say Biafra is a spirit, to them it's a slogan. Oh, woke Abara Biafra woke Abara. The people that even appease her don't know her. So each time we come, we're pointing out some things to you. It is so that as we are saving ourselves spiritually, the same way we should also be able to save ourselves physically. We must not forget that there is virtually no history, no culture, no tradition of any race that do not have this mystical influence attached to their culture or historical background. There is no civilization, nobody in the world. When they tell you about mystical island, they tell you about many things. Most of them in the world still preserve this site. Our ancestors have theirs. Somebody will travel all the way from Europe and come and destroy your own. And when Europeans or imperialists stop destroying it, Yoruba pastors are the ones leading you to destroy it. And some of our brothers are there doing deliverance. You are, you are killing yourself and you are saying you are doing deliverance. I'm not here to tell you a story that makes you look good. I'm here to help you so you wake up and understand what is at stake. Yoruba native doctor and Fulani native doctor, Awosa native doctor, they have rounded us up. Do you know in, in DSS they have native doctor there? Do you know in DSS office they work with native doctor? The first thing they do is to run oracle on you. To know what you are carrying. Nigerian DSS is what I'm telling you. We were there. We have been there. But the other one says, oh, it's is evil. There is no native doctor of Biafra land in Biafra land that does not have police registration. So when police apprehend you, all those Boko Haram, and they shoot you, it does not enter, they will torture you till you tell them the native doctor that did that for you. And what be tell that native doctor if it's not registered? So that is why, when most of them do a DSC for you, as you are walking out, they will call police on you. But I'm coming, you know, because this war you are running from, we are remembering those who fought a war that they never called for, who fought a war that they never initiated, 10 million or more have to die for it. Today, the same signal is written all over the cloud. And we are here doing fine boy inside brokers. We are here trying to claim relevant. Don't worry. Omen, omen, izu, omen, wa. Omen, omen, izu, omen, wa. I always tell people, if Biafra, Nigerian murder soldier, ravaged Southeast, why did you think they didn't come to Bender State, where I come from? You think they, they come and give us pure water? As Umunede, they will tell you how they defend their land. As Orogodo, they will tell you how they defend their land and what happened in Yorogodo. They enter that bowl. Kanele nyangu leko jilu engu. Webulu abu wongyo swa 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 Am I calling you to come and fire us? Eh? Find out why your father did those things. And it will amuse you. Some enemy, you don't need to chase them away. If I give you one secret now, what will begin to happen in your villages, you will be shocked, but not here. We will get there. You cannot will a power you know nothing about. It will destroy you. That is why some people, little power will enter their head, they start misbehaving. 
every cultural civilization, every breed red of Homo sapiens, they know these things and they preserve it. Let's just look at three of them. The, these areas are referred to the 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 the, 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 the most forbid, forbidden area on earth. Nobody should go there. There are so many across the globe. Now juju that they do there or something worse than juju. But because it's not maybe in Africa, they give it beautiful name. They tell you a legend that moved to a, 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 a warrior and a warrior who moved to a legend. They give you cockaboo story. They preserve their own. But your own Yoruba pastors are gallivanting everywhere in Biafra now. Oh, it's evil. It's evil. Demolish it. I don't say, oh God, forgive us the sins of our ancestors. And I begin to ask myself a question. For 400 years, the Europeans, the Americans, the Portuguese, they raped our mother. They murdered us. Yes, because we are stupid. Almighty Creator did not kill them. Where was he 400 years of slavery? And then ignorantly, let's assume, I carve tree and wash and worship. Then God come and kill me. I will ask that God question one day. Ibu chuko nye na gwa mori amo analego. Ibu chuko nye ne chi be zirezi. Mwane otu nye o. Ibu chuko apatane kungwa o. Ibu chi me he. Ibu chuko ebo ge madwe. You will know this truth. I want you to check it now. God was there in heaven according to you. For 400 years, the black was raped. The black was robbed. The black was murdered. Because we are stupid, I agree. And God kept quiet. It's not punishing no Igbo. They are the one providing us a private jet, giving us comfort. Green flag, a green rapture. Wonderful land we lived. Let us reason. No. They are minor things. If you do not put this principle together, other people will be controlling us. Unnecessarily. When you talk about Freemason, when you talk about other occultic group in the world, do you think they are coming to drink pan, pan wine and then and yap and go ahead? The reason Nigerian has not been spiritually enslaved is because of the multiple religion there. One day you people will understand. All the 400 years of raping and mob, God didn't hold them. And now I call, call to three, begin to worship the tree. Then God converts, conquer 10 million people. Let me stop there. I won't digress further. Now, number one of these forbidden areas in the world is one. You have a snake island in Brazil. There is a snake island in Brazil. This piece of land is where it is said that you have the highest number of snakes almost in the whole world. The snake in this island in Brazil is so many that their venom can melt a human being. And when they saw it, they fenced the place around and say it is no go area. You can pay money and go and look at it. Go and google it. The Snake Island in Brazil. That is Juju. But because it's Oyibo, it's uh, one of the, maybe the 13 wonder of the modern world. They give it good name. It's Juju. We have such in our land. We have such in our land. If your village still have snake that con that guide your village now, Yoruba pastors must have killed it, or one idiot pastor in your community. We say that is why you people are not progressing. Oh, you both that is stealing all your day and night. As I'm talking to you now, people in Bonnet Island are dying. All of them are dying as a result of being poisoned. Oh, you both sheep is still there stealing all your. They don't care for them. Bonny Island, as I'm speaking now, people are falling. Don't say it's Niger Delta land. Igbo are dying in Bonny Island. Biafras are dying in Bonny Island. Go there now. Or oh, Igbo are still stealing oil. Because they don't care for us. But why would they care for us when we don't care for ourselves? So they have this snake island in Brazil. You will go and pay money and look at it. Oh, it is the wonder of nature. Nature is beautiful. But if it were to be in Abo, 
by now you will understand the way they will bend their mouth and say only oh, this is a juju this everything is a juju yeah, they are doing juju and if i don't say it's arrow say arrow say what is arrow say let's continue the second one you have the not the the, the not sentinel island the north sentinel island in india now when i studied that island they said it's a mysterious island very dangerous island the inhabitant of that island if you see them they are very vicious they are very carnivorous they don't let anybody come there they do this they do that they do that do you know what is in the uh, north sentinel island in india it is black people most those of you in india don't you see black people that are darker than me but there are breed of black people they could not exterminate because they want to wipe out the black they are the one inhabiting that island they give them mysterious name cajo them call them different name but these people stood their ground over 1000 years plus they stood their ground they said they don't want telephone they don't want technology they don't want anything they want to remain black chimpanzee that they are these are african black men in india they face them off and call it mysterious island but if it's Africa, they say it's a juju, it's a juju, 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 don't go there, it's a juju. They will be doing deliverance. Where are all our prophets? Where are all our Nazarians? We are the one that use our hand to babble the other day because they are evil, they are possessed. Our fathers who put it there, why don't you find out? If you say it's not important, why are you now having full any native doctor in Enugu? What is he doing there? Holy communion. He's giving Enugu people holy communion. Let us open our eyes. Oh. I talked about some issue recently regarding sharing of broadcast of our leader and not sharing of broadcast of our leader. Our uh, people were like, hey, he really doesn't mean he's uh, this one, is he that one. Why are you rejoicing now that you are trending on Twitter? If what I'm saying does not mean, why are you rejoicing that you want to trend on Twitter? When I know get sense. Let me not digress. Eza gwale moku ye bun shara hime beli chane. Eza gwale moku. Eze hon se wa gwala uku. Ye jie kwa ye bun shara hime beli. And then we look at the third one because of time. It is called the Dwarf Bins in New Mexico, US. In this place, you don't go there. Nobody is allowed to enter there. It is fully blocked. Defenses. Sometimes they say alien come there. Sometimes they say this one happen. They do a lot of experiment. They cross breed human being and goat. There is nothing they don't do there. From that place they produce technology. If I tell you people there are people using ta time travel already, you will not believe. If we tell you what the world is capable of, why Bill Gates and others want to poison all of you in the name of COVID-19? It will shock all of you. And he says it's a conspiracy theory. When he's revealing the truth, it becomes conspiracy theory. If he's about Africa, my is juju, is juju, is juju, your Obama pastors will come and cancel it. Now, let me stop there. Go and do your research. In this study, I want us to consider some of the some of them in view of benefiting from participating. Number one, why do they keep domestic animal? Why do our ancestors keep domestic animal at home? In those days, there is no home you will enter without seeing a domestic animal. Have you ever wondered why they do that? Have you ever wondered? Let's look at some of the reasons. Let's consider most of the domestic animals they keep at home and why they do it. There is dog fowl. Some of you know dog fowl. If you bring out dog fowl and put it on the highway, I tell you, a driver will prefer to fall inside the river than to jam that dog fowl. Dog fowl is not in a hurry. As a driver is approaching with speed and he sees a dog fowl from Nigeria, the side of Biafra land I come from, you don't jam dog fowl. Everybody is afraid. 
Hey, you can't beat it though. There are a lot of superstitions behind it. None of us are trying to find out why is it that way. Let's look at number one domestic animal. Chicken. Or cocoa. In those days, there is virtually a home you will enter without seeing native fowl. No home. Every home you must see fowl or cocoa. You must see fowl. And I, I remember as a child, most of this fowl, most of this hen or cock, as the case may be, can stay in our house for seven years. You don't have to kill them. They keep growing and they keep growing and they keep growing and we wake up one day, seven will die. We throw them away. They keep growing, they keep growing and we wake up one day, my parents may decide to sell them to reduce the population. But I understand the sole purpose of training this chicken was not because they lack meat. Of course, it's part of it. But there were more secrets why they keep chicken in their home. Not a Greek fowl, native fowl. Now, let me give you a history. It was three years ago, I was poisoned. Because of this same Biafra, I lie down on one particular position in my sitting room for 17 days. I didn't stand up. My flesh has almost completely liquidified. It has melted. I just look like a salophine bag carrying water. It was only my mouth that can talk. Of course, my wife is a midwife. She observed me. She did everything. She knew I was going. She called my family, my parents, and said, come and look at your son. This one has passed me. And my sister came from home that day and brought juju yes you heard me juju my sister came from our boy she came with juju because then give me juju to come out the juju then bring juju to me did you hear me yes reverend george said the sister bring juju for him because this is the truth that make you people fear how does this juju look like the juju was one pepper soup all the way from our boy Travel for almost 14 hours to bring pepper soup for me. It is an ordinary pepper soup. And then my sister, they looked at me. My sister said, try and stand up so that you lick this soup. And I stood up. I took the soup. I licked the soup. The soup was very bitter, very pepperish, at the same time very hot. Confirm African spirituality. I lived and I lived and I lived. I stood up immediately after 17 days. I went to vomit. My sister said, no, no. Brother, vomit in no day this one. You must remain for your beleo. You know, as a big boy, you have to form big boy. It's like when they want to give you injection as an adult. You are afraid to, but you'll be forming big boy. My younger sister forced me. I said, brother, you must do your belly. And I took it again. He said, soup, oh, soup, juju. Because that is the side you don't want to hear. Because you are too holy, more holy than Enjel Gabriel. But we are coming. And I licked the soup. And I hold it together. It was in the night. And I slept off. In the morning, at about around 7 a.m., my younger son came to me and said, Daddy, there is a fowl at your window. And I don't train fowl. I don't have domestic animal. And I kept quiet. I said, okay, I have heard you. He was still looking out outside the window. And then after a while, he said, Daddy, the fowl is struggling. He looked like he want to die. I didn't mind him because he's a child. And then in less than 10 minutes, he said, Daddy, Daddy, the, the, the hen is dead. And so I stood up. Another fowl from another compound entered my compound, passed through the gate, 
came to the window of my bedroom, stretched himself, and died there. Immediately I stood up. Immediately I recovered. I recovered immediately. And I kept quiet. And I was like, what is going, what is going on? And I remember that my mother told me that the reason why they train chicken at home is that some night the spirit of death can be sent against somebody. But that if your hand is clean, as far as they have sent out the spirit of death, it cannot return empty-handed. It must collect blood. So when the spirit of death visits your home and your hand is clean, he will take one animal and walk away. But they prefer chicken more often. I say, okay, now I remember. From that day to today, I recovered. Is God not wonderful? But you don't know this thing. So why would you train native fowl? Like I told you, in those days, we can have them up to like 70. You wake up one morning, you will see 10 will die. My parents never feel bad. They never quarried. Because they knew something evil came to that house. The Bible says, without the shedding of blood, there will be no remission of sin. That is why he told the children of Israel, the spirit of death will move among you tonight. Make sure you have blood on your door. If it does not take blood, it's not going anywhere. Now you know why they train foul. Do not neglect it. Try and have a domestic animal at home. That is one. I just give you personal experience. Let's go to the next one. Dog. In those days, we have dog. The Bible says because of a plate of food, a dog can be loyal unto a master for a lifetime. Sometimes when we do certain things, we do not consider the spiritual implication behind them. Our leader came here one day and told us how many people that were killed in his house. And when he finished saying it, he said something. Even my dog, Jack, was killed. A lot of people are not comfortable with that. Uh, he didn't mention the name of people key. He was calling Jack. But there are things you don't know. Dog has a spiritual role he plays. Dog will know that your full and gate man, the hand is not clean. Dog will know. The dog will try to communicate with you. But if you are not somebody that is close with your dog, you do not understand how your dog functions. Your dog will know. But what your dog will do, your dog will be monitoring that evil. In those days as a child, there is a fame, one Indian fame. I can't remember the name. Where dog went to do revenge. I've forgotten the name. I watched this as a child. Dog are your real security. The sense between the physical and the spiritual. The problem is that they cannot attack the spiritual enemy. But they can alert you. But the physical enemy, to the best of their ability, they will ward them out. If they poison your food in your compound and you have a local dog, a native dog, not a Rottweiler, not a Igbo dog, a Sensual dog, crossbreed dog. If you have our normal Igbo dog, Biafran dog, if they poison your food, that day you will see your dog will run. What the dog has not done before, the dog will go and do it. The dog will go and eat that food. That is what we show you people that that food has been poisoned. Today you see some oh, after eating soup, the whole family died. If they have dog, that will not happen. It's difficult to happen in those days. When you have this dog in your house, our ancestors understand their rule. Today, the dog you have now, they take and make breast. You breastfeed them. The dog be doing well, 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 well. They sleep more than you. Some dog even have a seat. That is not the one I'm talking. Native dog, they, they can't name the answer self. You begin to hear bingo, bingo, skippy, skippy. Not those one you call John, John, Mike, Mike. 
All those ones are human beings already. This dog plays a lot of role in your house. They alert you. They protect you without knowing. You just see a one Fulani will come and then enter a house, rob everybody, shoot them. Nobody can even challenge them. If you have a well-trained dog, even though that dog will die in the hand of that Fulani man, that dog will make alarm. That dog will make effort. This is our culture and tradition. Other people don't do that, but we do it. And now you will understand why it took them so many years before they could conquer our ancestors. Go and find out how Ethiopia ward out the enemies from being able to colonize them. They were even training lions like dogs. Go and ask the imperialists. From Portuguese to German to Europe to America, every country that have attacked Ethiopia, all of them failed, not just because of their landscape, because they understand the need to activate domestic animal to fight on their behalf. Let's go to the next one. You now have good. Why do they have good? That one is for domestic profit, domestic purposes. Today, if you look at every home, they are crying. Oh, we are hungry. We are not working. Oh, coronavirus. Oh, oh to, 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 to. But let me tell you, for savings, for financial benefit, the train good. Imagine as you're speaking, you have five goods you have been training. This time you will take one and sell it. And of course, good give birth two times in a year. And if you are lucky, sometimes it can give you eight, between four and eight in a year. And our people, our ancestors, don't need to get hungry. In some communities in Biafra land, according to their tradition, if you marry their wife, they give you a goat. They give you a female goat. In most cases, some of them will be pregnant. At least when I went to do my marriage, they gave me a goat, a female goat, the family. And when I came back, the goat was pregnant. The result that we didn't know, you know, because of church, I have to kill it, do pepper soup for church. Everybody rejoiced. But imagine if I did not kill that goat. He had two goats and delivered two goats more. It becomes three. As far as I have where I keep them, they begin to grow. Full honey taking our land is not because of goat and cow. Today, now, if full honey even move out their cow and goat, you see our own is almost gone. Meanti Allah is ruling Nigeria through cow. Don't you see we can rule Africa through our own goat? It was for financial purposes and benefit. You don't, you don't labor to train them. Our good, they are very wise. There are parables in my place. And not until I see my parents trained good, I would have said those parables don't have meaning. One of them is, which means, if God gets angry, a bite like dog, most of you don't know. That goat you are seeing doing, meh, 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 meh. if you provoke goat, you will know it can bite like dog. What am I saying? They are there for a purpose. Imagine where you live. You are training goat. And in one year, it becomes eight. And you keep doing that. You cannot be broke to the extent that you don't even have 5,000. All you need to do is take the goods to the nearest market. You sell it off. You start from there. We look at one more. Cat. They, 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 they condemn cat and condemn cat. They use it for juju. They use it for witchcraft. They use it for this. They destroy cat. Up to the essence that they will tell you legendary have it that black cat is evil. The same way dog can ward off physical enemy, 
cat word of spiritual enemy. They said cats can see between the living and the dead. There are spiritual beings everywhere. If you look at some of the forbidden places, there are a lot of buildings in the world today that are haunted by ghosts. People are there, you won't see them. And when such influence are in your home, it is the cat that frightens them. They can't stop. You have cat in your house, no witch can press you. One day, I, I came back from boarding school then. It was in the night, and I slept in the kitchen in the sitting room. I was still young then. And then as I slept, somebody came to hold my neck. They hold my neck. It was so serious that I saw the person's face. Our house is a story building. And immediately I, I stood up from the chair. The person jumped through the window, jumped down, and ran away. The person almost killed me. And then as I turned and I looked at another side of the sitting room, our cat was looking at me as if he was fighting something. And I woke up and I told my father. My father said it is the present of the cat that ward away that evil spirit. And now, these are the little things we know. Brothers, I will not pass here today. Tomorrow, we continue from other domestic animals and plants that serve a divine purpose in our family that we know nothing about. Those of you in Biafra land, you have to do something. Fulani will protect one cow. Instead of you to kill their cow, if they can even die for their cow. You think cow is just cow you are eating? Do you know the sacrifice cow carry for Fulani people? Do you know the juju they do with cow? So the cow is in your money. Cow can go to Aso Rock and see Buhari. Cow can go to National Assembly and nothing will happen. Cow can go to university and you cannot do anything. Do you think it's ordinary cow? There are spiritual influence you have not seen. And if we do not take time, cow will take over our land. But then we have the goat to ward them off. We have the pussy cat to ward them off. We have the dog. We have the hen. We have things that will take over this dead from us, even without us making a single noise. And of course, at this moment, our lines will be open. And I expect you to call in and give us brief history about this culture and tradition. Because these are some of the things that makes us who we really are what we are really proud of, what we are fighting for. I'll be back in a minute. Biafra is a only It is
Yes, of course, at this moment, our lines are open. Of course, when you call in, you tell Biafra some of these things because, believe me, we will need everything that we have to ensure we save the next generation of Biafra. At this moment, our lines are open. Our WhatsApp line is 70 815 is our WhatsApp line. Uh, direct line is 081-221-52971, 081-221-52971, and the special number for the female is 081-288-58614, 081-288-58614 is the special number for the female, please let know male call the female line yes call her on the line your name and where are you calling from call her on the line good evening my brother go ahead please your name and where are you calling from this is your man, Don Konyo, from Abahia. Uh, you have told the whole thing. Ndin Kanya Mahunya Napo, Neto and the Koto. Ndin Kanya Mahunya Napo, Neto and the Koto. Some people are my Yan Eku. I never walk with a chino menala. What did they feel? No, okay, good. And the Lanya ni Mehane Mugua Oko Srika. Our people Latin our culture. Oko Srika, our people Latin our culture. Makilanya Mbembu and when a culture here in the Afra land, in Adi Hotua. All things Britain and the Nigeria, but I may be here our culture. Some of the pastors, I'm in Hanako. Some of them, Ndi Yoruba Tana Yishi. Some of them, I'm in Hanako. But major here now, one of the pastors, Kahamuike Latina, our culture. Onwe inye kariri omena ala. Onwe inye kariri omena ala. Onwe inye geme kai survive wo. Now this is the Afghan issue. Now who are men are Master Johnny I will stop here. This is your man, Don Konyo, from Aba. Thank you very Thank much. You. Let me remind us, let me throw, I take our mind back to certain issue. Do you know how much they sell a bottle of camel urine? What, why are they training camel? Why is camel urine so expensive? If I tell you what the urine of your goat can do to those full and idiot, Running up and down in your village, you will be shocked. Call on the line. Your name and where are you calling from? Call her on the line. Hello? When you call me, please turn off your radio. Call on WhatsApp. Good evening. Good evening from here. Move away from your radio. My name is Maxwell Chinyaka. I'm calling from Bamako, Mali. Go ahead. Hello. Go ahead. Uh, George Nibe, your topic this night is very. George Nibe, your topic this night is very fantastic about our tradition. I remember something happens. About five years ago, about in my family where we have a, a dog, there is a medicine that is implant where they buried my father. Our dog go there and put that medicine. Can you hear me? Go ahead, the word is listening. Our dog go there and put that medicine. If, Unfortunately, if... my uncle saw, saw our dog where it's digging ground. I digging ground and put that medicine. Color say see, see who killed my father. I go, I come here and plant this medicine. Since that day, I can't remember the word of my father told me about your statement. Tonight. 
My father told me the reason that he made them to have domestic animal. He, he, he tell me an Igbo proverb. He say, "Omu baby boom the burro, and man." And I remember all those things. I even my father told me in olden days. My father told me about this church, uh, church on the way he spoil our tradition. You see, in olden days, you and person we talk agreement, you will be like that. But now you and person we talk agreement, you wrote it later on. The, the person now denied you. He said we should go back to our root. It will be this, the solution of everything. God bless you. Thank you very much. Like what our brother said. Somebody will come and bury charm in your house. You may not be there. If you remember, I said that sometimes why poison cannot kill the family is that when some dogs see that the food in your house has been poisoned and they can't tell you, the dog will go and eat the food and die there. It signals you off. That is why the Bible says, for a plate of food, a dog can be loyal to a master even unto death. We used to sleep on the same bed with our dog. They understand us. Dogs we have had, my parents has had in 30 years, 20 years backwards. I still remember their name. But I need you to understand the role these things play. You think these people are, are manipulating all of us with intellectual and British influence intimidation? No. They are using juju for all of us. Look at all our politicians. Once you vote for them, the day they enter Aso Rock, their life can never remain the same again. They remove their brain and put it on hunger. When you are talking, they will be like that teacher flogging you that you are speaking your language in the school. Call on WhatsApp, are you there? Good evening. Good evening from here. Go ahead, please. My brother, I'm very happy about the program this night because... Some of our people are there, but they don't understand. And we're different between all. This is what you call calling all the way from Yaoundé. And well, if a DJ from all and tradition, that is very big different there that our people don't understand. You are talking about tradition. Some of us here, and the boy, hey, hey, I am talking for you. Hey, I'm going to have a man. Okay, do, 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 do. Sherry Baba, Sherry Baba. They don't, they don't know their that. father. They don't know their father. That That's is just the problem. Exactly, yes. Exactly what we are talking here is your tradition. Odinana, Ominana, Ndi. Sorry, let me tell you something. Do, do you know? Do you know that some of the pot, clay pot, they took from Anambra, they took from Abo, they took from Benin, they took from Ebony. They went and store it somewhere in, in, in Britain. They call it museum. That our people go there to look clay pot and pay Yiboma money. Do you know you our imagine? people in UK go and look at their grandfather, their ancestors' pot and mat, and pay Yiboma money for it? And you want those people to respect you? Go ahead, please. Yes, this is very uh, and, uh, uh, tradition and the world. It has been a problem to our people. When we talk about herbalists, people started seeing that as the okay, go, no, go. on our world with a herbalist. Don't you understand that any doctor is a herbalist? Then when the herbal ones, we did go here with Nili, with all those ones are herbalists. The doctors, we did go with the refined ones. Those ones, they call it medical doctors. We don't simply understand it. If we don't anything about tradition, a pastor a pastor friend told me that the name of chuko kikabiyama is evil that we are worshiping idol that the name of chuko kikabiyama is evil spirit and Igbo man for that matter and i said you in your own mind because you are pastor chuko kikabiyama now is a name of Igbo deity I say, I'm sorry for you. It's simple. Our people must understand this thing and embrace it. Our leader said something yesterday. He said, Fulani man is a native doctor in Enugu. That means, I can tell you, everybody in that community, why was that 
the accomplished ram. No human being there again. No human being. Have you seen any Awosa full animal without talisman? But don't worry. We will get there. They, they will reject it. But they will see the errors of their way very soon. If we know these things, we can't prevent these people from using it against us. Of course, in our next edition, a lot of it will be reviewed. Go ahead, please. Diko, our Womaka tradition, don't get it or start seeing it as that your church is abolished. No. We are saying that now the bending or the bending or the understand. I can remember those days when when the war were, were picked up were against us uh, 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 in 1967. Do you know that they were secured with uh, uh, what they call um, that is uh, 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 that, um, the the peace, you know? Those criminals, no you know, because what they were was they were under their tradition, and their tradition was escape them from death. But people don't all those things nicely. If I was a kid, I did a woman, I did a woman, I did a woman, I did a woman, I did a I did a woman, I you don't simply understand your tradition any longer because you believe in your church or you believe in your house or whatever you are going to. Would you imagine you are talking now? A, a, a pastor is saying talking about Chuku Okikabiama. What is Chuku? And what is Okike? And what is Abiyama? Why can't you also understand this thing? Very simple. I just have to stop here, my brother, so that all others will cheat in my brother. Thank you. Thank you. We... It a very good ahead. You're making your making... Yeah. Thank you very much. Call on the line. This line is for the female. Please. Good evening, sir. Good evening. Try and call the male line, please. Caller on the line, your name and where are you calling from? Please, no male should call the female line. Caller on the line, your name and where are you calling from? Monitoring spirit. All over the world. Our leader, tell them the canoe, so I can No one that is who you are. The whole world I'm not giving you a man. Mark, Mark chapter 14, verse 2, 1 and 9, read it. Then, from verse 21 to 31, read it. For read it from 1 to N. How oh, religion you know here? Uno <laughs> I'm going to go to the 
Thank you very much. I will appreciate when you call and tell me this thing I'm saying is lie. Because in my own community as a Biafra, it doesn't have that weapon that way. Or rather, you call in and tell me this thing you said is true. Because in my own community, it does happen that way. There are a lot of cultures and traditions that when I begin to mention them here, they are very raw. But there is a reason why their ancestors did it. And as far as they are loyal to certain influence, their life become what they really are. There are men and women who are working hard to wipe out the children or the, the apple of God's eye from existence. You wouldn't understand. There is no history of the world that is not of that of humiliation, of that of oppression, of the black man. The question should be, why are all of them afraid of you, black monkey and chimpanzee, as they say we are? Why are they afraid of us? It is pathetic. I started this evening by reminding you that they used to flog us in our own school. How dare you speak your mother tongue? You are evil. They will flog you in your own school. You don't know you have to speak the imperialist language. And then there are people who are listening to the line of my English. They say it's not learned, it's not cultured, it's not, it's not Queen's English, Arab English. That is how they say our ancestors speak. But that ahun ah is a misery they can never uncover. Does it not amaze you that when they discover one single piece of stone from the Kemites, they will search for the meaning all their lives? Why did they demolish the pyramids in Udi? If the pyramids in Udi was here, one Yoruba pastor would have told you that is why Nugu is not progressing. Go and destroy it. Oh, I will say, you will join them. Make we tell ourselves the truth. You see our people. You think it's their eye? Our people, most of our people are jumping up and down. It's a lot of people. It's a lot of people. It's a lot of people. Kola and WhatsApp, are you still there? Yeah, good evening, sir. Thank you for holding on. Good evening from here. Your name and where are you calling from? This is Chikre Zia calling from Aba. Uhuru Choma, what you make? Thank yes. you. Go ahead. What I want to contribute this evening is this. When the white people came, they brought evil against us. See what I want and us to they focus on. See what, I work on. See what I want us to focus on when you call. Tell me some of this character that manifests yeah. in your village. Does it happen? Has your father told you anything about it? Is it evil? Let our people know. Let's forget about the evil they brought. We understand. Let's forget about some of those churches. I am just pointing it out because I need people to be aware of them. 
where you know who your enemies are. They cannot conquer you. They say the war they prepare for does not eat cripple. Our people must understand because then go use juju scatter all of our head. We go they halal lolo lolo ya. Tell our people direct them so they begin to go and ask their father a question. Somebody just wrote to me from a boy state yes, and sir. say this thing you said in my own community. It's not only the fowl that carries death that they normally pray that any death that will visit their house should please take any domestic animal in their house and leave them alone. And the person even wrote it in Nza language. Go ahead, please. Those are the areas I want us to focus on. Go ahead. Yeah, our culture permits that. And what you are saying is the simple truth. My grandmother told me in the olden days when I was with her, she told me that domestic animals are for reasons. What are the reasons? That when anything like death comes to the family, why they were sleeping? Of course, we lost that uh, caller. I hope I can get him back because of Zoo epileptic network. But until then, we'll continue. Our people must understand there is a reason why all these things are coming up. Call on the line, your name and where are you calling from? Hello. George Good evening from here. Yes. Oh, the from Aguata. Aguata, Wachineke. I can't do a for a merengini, Kibiafra. And if a Nicaro Ekuo, if any name Eku, Oku walk over. And the more when I got to the Naha. Program. I have a Oh, yeah, we have a sofa kita. Kila and Nandibu, so Nandi Makarichan, no wa. Manandibu Nata, Fukaria, Ono, Ndobuna, no wa. No, because when I have a woman alive, Mugendo Chanabia, Ono Budobuna, then I leave Tanando Chalong. I have a number, I have a number, I have a number, I have a number, I have a Ebahawe <laughs> What <laughs> Nihendi <laughs> 
mon ari fu ele nje etu ngale esi eku eku na radio na ko wata na eni le aka e ko wata iba ma ki ha ina eku bu exactly ni de mobi so how you say just hold the line let me take your number i will call you later just hold the line okay just hold the line i'm coming all right i have your number kifibo afage biko good evening sir kifibo afage okay okay chuku mauchi okay okay don't worry i will call you tomorrow by the grace of god because I will talk to you tomorrow. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. God bless you. And bless you too. Yes, uh, caller on WhatsApp, your name and where are you calling from? Call on WhatsApp. Call on WhatsApp. Are you there? Yeah. Uh, Good evening from Good here. Good evening, my African net. Afambo, uh, I'm calling from Kenya, East Africa. Go ahead. Enjoy uh, Bobna. Enjoy Bobna. You are this evening. You are always my teacher, my lecturer. Whenever I listen to your voice, I'm very, very happy. Always happy listening to your voice. It gives me extra joy. It, I forgot everything. I forgot everything. Very, very happy listening to your voice always. So now who I know who today? Omegum. Omegum. Because when I was in, in the, my village, there's a time I will atolo. I will leu. I will inketa. I will okoko. So now, pure truth without any. Already eight years I call him Mili. pure truth. It has been happening. My father told me that. My grandmother told me that. Oh, fuluna. He 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 said for you make you onu kwa piambu at onwe mu sai no i no na la rola atola be ba one scobel i put up no onrugo my ini no onra na ade lieli ade liel la ini ni ni kamado my father say oh to why bleed i in here oni kai ni ni ade lieli so na ini ni ni hubo pure truth it it fresh me back on the days when I know how was he, he had not all those things. I will have to look, I will leave all those things. I will see she, she, where, where, bam, even as you say, now all those things was in case. So let, let me tell you yeah. now, eh, if we wake up now and say, let's start training our goods and cows, Nigeria will write a policy there to destroy our poultry. They introduce bear flu. But most people don't know. They destroyed our poultry, so we can be eating the sacrificial yeah. lamb, the god of the new yeah. Go ahead. Can you be those any lizzy, lizzy, if you, sacrificial lamb, if you, 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 Nduka, Nduka, Nduka will, 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 Thank you very much. Uh, my brother on Facebook, uh, you go by the name. Let me search out your name because your question is a very interesting one. And uh, let me go back a little bit. Your name is Dan Freeman Nwankwo. 
than free man one call you say oh god why don't you use this power to chase the fulani away a uh, don't free man one call if you are listening to me you should go and ask oliver the coco about one of his uh album track he actually say and now that is just by the way anyway somebody owns the town somebody owns the town and without the consent of the owners of the town you can't do anything you cannot without the owners of the town giving you the go ahead you can't do anything you think fulani are crazy now boy do I give you name? You think Fulani are now about running ramp rampaging? Then do anyhow, then see anyhow. You can go and cause problem there, but you will give testimony of what will happen to you. You know, no say there is a difference between you are crazy and you are mad. But the son of Enugu cannot go to Omambara and tell them what happens, how they carry off for. It won't work. Everybody will answer their father's name. There are things that we can do. We, you, you cannot do it except somebody gave you the right. You see where the, the, the challenges are. And when the imperialists discover this truth, what do they do? In a home, they will divide all of them. First son is Aglican. Second son is Presbyterian. Third son is uh, Bottles and Kankan. The other one is Sacrophy and Seraphim. Then one is Ogomo. So, which of them will take over from their father? Do you know that there are some children of high priests who will say they will not continue with their father's profession? And then if there is nobody in that family that can continue from where their father starts, it goes to the another family. It's not something you jump in and you do. There are decisions no single man have the right to take on behalf of our people. You don't. Until everybody unanimously agree and say this is who you are. And that is why sometimes when we come on air, we make people to understand. Mazen Nandekan is our supreme leader. Not because he gave us money. Not because he's looking for who to rule. Not because he wants to terrorize anybody. But because there is need for us to unanimously agree identify one man and ordain him to go and destroy the nonsense people on our way as far as all of us begin to drag who will be the leader we are not going anywhere how many people rule awosa awosa fulani the moment they say we did not announce that is over game over for yoruba awosa fulani including Ibu and niger data the moment yoruba say omodudu wale mio game over for all of you Ibu, all of you john niger data awosa fulani but when you come here now, they say, the man is not the kind, he says, he wants to lead us, he wants to lead us. The other one says, no, I'm a born Niger Delta, I'm equal to Niger Delta. But no, I'm not condemning you anyway. If you are Niger Delta, it's okay. But we need to unanimously agree. Without that, the gods of our land will not follow you. You know, understand. My brother and WhatsApp, are you still there? Of course, I have two WhatsApp online already. Arinze, Mazi Arinze, hold on for me. Then uh, the other yep. was up. Yep. Go ahead, please. Go ahead. As 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 the matter when they do what in a man on a gate. No could be. Oh my, any homie young gap or lining. Oh, not on a tone, a tone money. A billary hooked up, no see only. K was on one. I want a guam. A slow boy make a slow boy make a game with a you may care. Um, first of all, Mazon, you be. You get this, you get this opportunity. You get my million doing your Mazon and the canoe. I'm so worried. I'm so worried. Ma Mazon and the canoe. Onya, onya, sharp, onya, onya. And you do a poor miscrant. And you do general. Why not money here? Current this well, professor, the lecturer, the doctor, the well, the channel. Chukuki Kabia, my adu, my achime. So, so, look, boy, I am a me, okay, get a cousin in here, chon, I'm he said, he said, Amazon eBay, my contribution on this uh, topic this evening. Sometimes you make me remember my childhood. I could remember when we were small. If you if you are a nice person, maybe you do go to message for all these old older people, they will give you foul. 
I could remember when I was very little, they, they, there is this uh, chicken they gave to me. And one morning, one faithful morning, when I wake up from the sleep and this chicken was dead, I was crying. I was very bitter because I like that chicken. But my dad said, you shouldn't cry. You don't know the reason why this chicken died. The next day, they bought me two to replace that one. So I begin to see, I begin to remember so many things about our our tradition, about, about the way we grew up. And then things were moving fine. So this time around then, to God who made me, I don't just know what to say because we have lost almost everything. We can't even even remember things that we did in the past. And in those days, there was no crime. I could remember my daddy was telling me about the civil war in Agbo. He said nobody carry arm, nobody the, fight nobody. with these idiot people. Nigerian soldier and, invaded Agbo. that chased them away. Sorry, my land. brother. Nigerian nobody army invaded Agbo. One of the prominent Fulani son was slaughtered in Agbo garage. Nobody need to carry gun or cutlass or anything. Are they crazy? Nobody carried gun. They nobody think we are, we are here to talk. I... Nobody, nobody. From the moment they get to Uromi Junction, they divided. Both are from Egala land. From there, enter Asaba. They ravage what they ravage. Then they craze. When we are telling people, there are the reason why you are seeing them coming. When they kill Iboma, oh, they are killing us. Oh, they are killing us. Oh. When they kill Niger, they time. Oh, I pass, oh. This is unacceptable. And oh, to, 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 to. When men you make worry, you think it's easy to come and challenge me? You can use your position to victimize me. But when you are done with me, you know you meet somebody. When they tell our people that they do, oh, we're going to be civilized, we're going to be gentle. Look at the level they have religion. Nigerian soldiers, then they crazy. And they challenge them. Make them from Aso Rock enter Abo. And then after one week, they will understand. They will understand. And region when you go, we are here, 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 they never shot anyone in Abo. All of them know. Or Bas and John know. Oh, they kill us. They kill us. It's okay. We remember them. 30th of May. Now everywhere that they kill. Now everybody they kill, they come out. You don't know, say something, make them, they run for dog fowl. Everybody they fear to kill dog fowl. You don't know, say something, make them. Am I saying we are invisible? No. Am I saying they cannot invade Abo now? No. I am reaching you life and direct from Yorugudu. But I'm telling you, madness have level. Leave all those things. They came to our ball. They left the same way they came. They left. The only thing they did is they took our parents' money. What would they tell our people? They say, no, we are formidable. We are international. We are connected. We can be useless. We can be hopeless. We can be anything you say that you are. But when that time comes, you will understand that the pair of light is not in your hand. Our people must know all these things. Look at Fulani coming to land in our land very confidently. Some idiots are poisoning people in, in, in Bonny Island. And they do this with impunity. And all of us are speaking, where well, the Lord is not found in our land. You know, it's in Uwame. Go ahead, my brother. I'm sorry for interrupting so, you. So, so, no problem, my Ibure. So, what baffles me that how would people come and tell us that this is evil, this is evil, and this is what protected us? So, we should allow them to kill us, then we'll become righteous. Are you going to become Jesus Christ by, by all means? Now, they say this thing will protect the land, it will protect his people so that they will not be killed. And you do it to protect yourself. You said it's evil, you said it's a crime. I don't get what our people are turning into. We should ask ourselves a question. Why is it that these days, these days there is church everywhere? There is a lot of crime in our, in our land. I could remember when we were growing, nobody goes to your house to steal. You will not get arm robber. There is nothing I like I grew in my things. parents' house in Abo, in Urugudu, Marire well, Street to be precise. My daddy carried us to the farm. When my daddy carried us to the farm, you will see so many food along the road. Nobody touches it. I will say that the who owns this one, he says the owner of this farm. Why is this? He said it's okay. Nobody will touch you just because there is this uh, leaf or moon leaf on top of this, on top of all this blood. You can't dare touch it. Everything was peaceful. Why is that nowadays there is church all over everywhere? There is crime. 
And then, no, there was no crime. Nobody will rape anybody. Nobody will steal from anybody. My brother, we sh- our people, we need to go back to our roots. We need to go back. That is my contribution, my thank African you, Thank you very much. God bless you so God much. God bless you too, my brother. We must understand there are little principles. It, it, what I do not understand is this evening, when I look at the, uh, a post made by one of our brother, that is his in Noel Odechi, he said, I just remembering in those days when I speak my language, of course, which is Igbo, his language, then they start flogging him. They start flogging him. And I remember it happened to me. Brain damage. Today, when we tell someone, don't do like this, don't do like this. But you have never complained about Fulani killing and raping because your brain is damaged. People must understand. It doesn't really matter. It must be without interest. There are spiritual barriers. You cannot do something you are not permitted to do in another person's community. You cannot. No matter who you are. You think when you talk about Nigerian war, that they came to Abo. They not tap us. Oh, you people are Yoruba. You are middle beds. You are bed middle. Oh, you are bended. They not walk away. They took my mother money. If I tell you one history, it will shock you. We, we have our own share. But they came to drink water in our land. And we gave them enough water to drink. They are not in a hurry to come. Have you ever wondered for a Nigerian idiot army to come and invade the southeast? They are jumping up and down. Forget about those videos you are posting. I will fuck your mother. I will give you HIV. I will give... Is it idiot they come and tell that one? Where you call you pour water on the ground. You will only know that the ground has sucked that water, has drunk that water, but you will not see the mouth. We are telling our people there are things everybody needs to do. All these people will leave our land. A man in Anambra showed me a leave. If you plant this leaf on the four corner of any plot of land, any cow that will enter there will run mad. If they see Fulani headsmen, they go Kogi State. We are out of a gala, they go the Mumu. They do Fulani headsmen. You go headsmen, Fulani come back. Our people must understand this thing. Are you still there, Kola, Kola and WhatsApp? Sorry for holding you this long. <coughs> yeah, no problem, Mazi. Go ahead. Please. I greet you. Ne chukwo kika abi ama onye play mi he ni ne gozi erom ge. Ezu bote mo chine keke. I am I am arranged a chukwo koe. I'm calling from Vin Austria. I came from Nimo, in Ambara province, Biafra land. Our people must understand that it are the abomination are standing where it is not supposed to be in our land. It have been long time these people have been manipulating us in that our land Biafra. But the problem our people are having after this, I will tell I will tell us one 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 story I witnessed, and I was shocked to what these people are doing in the name of religion. Really, this is the problem that we have, and we must go back to our roots so that we will understand. It. We must understand what is after us and what is the meaning of that root, what our fathers have been holding. Without them, without being in being in Omenana or Dana from the most high, we will not be where we are today. I will not be born in Biafra land. Our people still, at least the little people there, will not be there. Mazi, did you understand during those da- during those days when we are playing when the moon will come out in the night like this? The- that time there is no fence. Everywhere we be happy, moon will just come out to like like is in the day. We are still kid that time. Everybody will be playing, laughing. But it's midnight too, but moon, but if you see wind, 
everything will be glorious. Everybody happy. Nothing like thief, nothing like your offense or whatever nonsense. And during those days, if you enter inside the bush, you will be hearing the voices of the wind. Wind, you will be hearing it because we are all in the spirit. The wind will be speaking. If bed, bed, this uh, bed, bed, if they are singing, singing whatever they are singing, you will be hearing it. Many of us are doing that. Any sign that came in that in that village in the bush, you will be here. You know, something will be teaching you, like there is some the, the one they call Ikwikwi. When Ikwikwi will be singing, Ikwikwi he used to sing when there is uh, 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 sometimes it will be singing when when there is danger. When danger wants to stroke, or when time, like exactly sometimes when it's 12 o'clock. That bird will come and be saying immediately. He come and say, quick, quick, go and check your time. It's twelve o'clock." All of them, our bird, our animals, everything in that beautiful land, they have things they are working for us during those days. At least we can get our people that are that are fitting our that are doing omenana and or the or the or the bend the area. Ndaka have what or people that are still righteous, not people that are worshiping idols these days that they don't even know. This is why Yoru, uh, uh, Yoruba people, Yoruba, Yoruba, when you see Yoruba, Yoruba is Fulani. Yoruba, for people that don't know, know Yoruba, that they are, they are, they are coming, guys, they don't have land. Yoruba are like Fulani, they are going everywhere, they don't have land, nowhere in this world. I'm telling you the truth. This is why they combine Yoruba. When you see, do you know that these people they are chief? They are they they are in Metiala. They are in Metiala. They are in Aliwa. They have been make research. When you see a, a Yoruba man there being they have control that have been chairman that place, you will be you guys you will be shocked. So the meeting that they, these people have done, it has been a long time. They, they invaded our, our, our land and our people don't know. They don't know that this is religion, this Yoruba church, Yoruba church, this Yoruba church that they are going. But they bring this one. They do the, this is all weapon. These people, they came, they, they, that is, they invaded us in, in every different single, everywhere. Let me tell you this one. There, there was one time, one time I was, uh, I, I went, my father was, you know, this, I don't really, I, I don't know what our people have eaten, you know, really, because there is one leaf you will eat like this, it will be going, it will be going direct to the, to the brain. So I don't know what uh, the, uh, 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 British people, uh, this Yoruba Fulani have given to our people. They, know, they don't, they know, they don't reason normal this time around. I'm telling you the fact. Sometimes I ask myself, where are the bloods of our ancestors, like Ekumek warriors, the people that defended us before? I went this place with my father that time he was alive. Because he said he was saying that uh, uh, there is some place they used to go, you know, pin. I don't know whether you know they say that people they used to put people pin in the body. That this man is removing pin in, in the body. That when the man we remove the pin. That is uh, the thing we go, they, they will be feeling nice. They will be, I say, what are you telling me? That time I came from, there is one country I came back from. I say, let us go. Let me see what you are talking about. Do you know, I went there with my father that very day. They are paying a lot of money, no be small money. And I know said either that man, either a rubber man or full and new ways, a big ways, they they are full in our land. They sabi speak every language where we speak. You go see me. You think I am brother? No, be a brother. No, be one. No, be no, be no, be the real blood of us. I catch the man now. Why yo? So immediately he reached our town. No, yeah, our town. But I go go first. I enter that place. Do you know what in this man they do? One stupid, what really? One stupid, but that time I I, I I like history, you know. I be history student and all this psychology, something, but I never go deep. When Nande Kano, our leader, I greet him very, very well and I salute each of them. 
very strong people. Do you know what this man did? This man, they, if they carry, if, if you see this man they carry for, <laughs> for hand, he, he, the man they carry pin, bottle, uh, stone, all these small, 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 small bottles, small, small uh, 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 pin, small, small, uh, um, this nail, small, small ones. You go carry them for, 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 for hand. You go carry olive oil. First of all, put olive oil for your body. Tell you, make you come out your shirt, come out all these things. You go put olive oil for your body. Then come carry, you don't go see, I mean, a sharp sharp. You go come carry that thing. They, they scrub you for body. Immediately that thing touch me. I say, bro, hey, bro, you just scratch me now. What's in that one? He, he, he throw him away. He say, na I say, bro, no joke. See, come on. Remove your hand, remove. <laughs> if you see what I do, come man. The man shocked, look me because not only me be young, young, uh, young guy waiting for that. But he just look me. I say what? So now this thing they do for our people for old, old. That, that place now, old, old people they come that place. At least not that kind old yeah, like that, but at least very much. Mad or all this. You understand what they talk? I I finish that thing. Come outside. Tell tell my papa. Tell and say. Papa, this thing now, you please, no, 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 just no, please, no, they give this man, no, they come here again. I think they are come for this place. Thank you very yeah, much. You know, my partner, very much. My partner, me say, you know, so really, we must, we must do something. We must wake up. Our people must wake up. Back to our root is the key. Here in Europe is what they are saying. Back to our root so that we will survive it. Thank you very much, my brother, for giving me this time. Thank you. And of course, we are inching closer to the end of uh, this very segment. Of course, I may be signing off temporarily, but I'm coming back immediately. So do not go anywhere. Our brother, I'm still trying to search out your, your name. He said our people should stop using... Our people should stop using all those poison to poison themselves. And that is what I've been begging them. All those people will do me a bad bet. I bet go checking point. Give unto all those Fulani. Where the police station, they rape. Yes, our brother, Eka Akachi, easy. You see, what I'm saying is, what of those our brother, father, mother, uncle, etc., that are giving people poison in the village? Or people that are in abroad? Why can't they use those poison? and kill all those idiots, all those animals, destroying our farm. The only thing they can do is to poison themselves, idiots everywhere. My brother Akachi, you are, you are right, and that is how I've been praying. Those of you who have uh, Abba bed, please give Nigerian police an army and full any headsmen. Give all of them Abba bed. Give them EB. That is what we are telling you. Akironweke. Anyone you know how to do, begin to give to them. Oga Meme Rugo, are you still there? Call on WhatsApp. Yeah, how are you been? Yes, good evening. Good evening, sir. Go ahead, please. Can I drag it? God bless you. I got drag it now, man. Ma, I can't wait. There you go. I have a okay, program from London. Oh, you been more than no hair bus ride a program. I know my decade no happy more than I've been at home now. Chuku gozegi gozebi afranile gozi onye nduai mazina ne kalo gozi our deputy uchemefo gozi nde jobi hini le na anwa nyano basara kanyo tonwa info biafra mazo yibe na balia programu idhole na balia odoga moto ubi to moto ngodi ama mazo yibe mana da tradition ya basara he traditional in a coup, more one year, he must stay to him a bomb be say. Here were a true story or more to more. Here, true story. A man that's in a hell about 25 to 30 years ago. Oh, man, it's something somebody met him. It's something I am now. The thing I know from the Kero, I might him a better thing is, and the more who somebody that can do it, when you make it. A man so when he be neji he this naga because of this problem. I got some Ghana care for the day. Got a guy a baby teacher. He just no resale nothing. 
or when some other some different Bibian Naga, a man that Mazonibe, a mention again, Kenga, the person said that na I got me with the working and I got no shimmy. Hey, Masse Moakwa, so I got the Mudikembo. So Yana took a cabiama, or when Boji direct Cham Simgawebe, I am Potebe. My father si he ka gweli ike. E mla aso nga ndo ma aso wone di biya ki biye. Aya ga kwe bo zo nye nke e se. Before men wet do wen bo, before he he gala mna hala, dat na age e bu di si madu. Hey, mpa mse, ya uro, ya uro ke ha ke akwo ya. O wong ya je e bu di si, wong ya a ke akwo ya na dat wan. So, ma zo yi ibe, ma ase, Aya gagide emiti kwe nyao zibia. Oye nke hese. Isera newe ishi madu. Mwa nga jine emie. Ema ya yasi dat na ewe de wongo koko. Weta apa wete mwane. Lizard. Aye pota nezi. Tia yi na village. Aye pota dia. Aye kuoku. Ubele ato. Ebe tuwe fwa klo ki mabale. Ema wansa yu kwe dat na. Iha ina ama ayama na ya. Dati na nge woko kwa na kwa nishi nge ye three times nishi. Nkwo dati na ihe mna ama ama na. Dati na ihe mula madu vuru bia. Bibu mno bumburo mwye. Nga se ule woko kwa he. Nge ye nishi mw. Right, unfortunate. I lost that call. I lost that call. If you can't call back again, I will accept that call. But I'm almost rounding up this segment. Call on WhatsApp. I just need to give you a few minutes, two minutes. My time on this segment is up. Go ahead, please. My brother, the last call If you can still call back, I will appreciate because I want to hear the end of what you are saying. Call on WhatsApp, Ujuku. Are you there? My brother, my brother, no, 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 why why is why you could say him onya onya muhika or making or swamia and as onya wondo onya onya bo onya bo onya onya bo onya ka onya nyoma onya bodo na sa sin him agu ane o na jade ta ki ha is why you could say as we go dey ta where where you no name why where you no say man ni e wonya be e wonya bo because you were data Igbo, yeah, quite cool. Where I was never data happy Igbo. He got no Igbo kill. A person really Igbo. It's you and me, me Igbo. On the one, on your one Igbo. Also, 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 on your bia, on your brave also. Yeah, go near Nugu also. Yeah, go near ah 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 Micha also. Where the where the local four one nine. On your journey, oh but oh oh where the oh baby where Jesus he. Uh, uh, calamity in my family so that numbers of by ages we why people not they understand it and many people are supposed to understand because of the winch where they don't chop for Yoruba uh, Yoruba land Yoruba not get any land like what, what, what waiting my brother talk I uh, Yoruba take get land Yoruba where where they for after Ukoko Michael they, they go to Seme uh, but I agree there where there in a dear Yoruba get rich even though part of the they, they go on the go like off come down and be a front not be there beneath people and uh, land in the country not be there you're about to enter you're about to enter inside bini in as a history because we know the key that they welcome then they come because of that they welcome then they come they don't know what they will take enter us they carry their nonsense women carry and give give our king then to marry as a second wife come from there they penetrate they enter inside bini Scatter everywhere, so they're saying that they get 
No, they got uh, any chance. Uh, of Be course, Oba of Benin are Yoruba man. Any idiot from Benin where they say he's a my Oba, he's my Oba, then be idiot. Uh, we never want to tell them the truth. The, the day we go tell them they are real secret, them. all of them go cover yeah. their face in shame. Yoruba man, therefore, uh, Oba of Benin, idiot, they they idiot to go they tell her. Oba talk, Oba talk, Oba Everywhere, mad people. Yeah, Just they summarize, they, they let's go mad. ahead. They say that they, they say that they, they say that be that be that be that be but uh, they use the Bini name with the answer. They destroy. They destroy their fallen. They go up and down. Just Where leave them destroy? there. Let us move ahead. Try and summarize. Uh, this, My time is almost uh, over. This uh, is this, uh, this, uh, Echo. Olden days. If Echo, 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 if you walk come here, you are come on. What you supposed to do? You supposed to give a white chalk. Echo go go back. You not come to destroy. He come to interview your compound. Echo. In Nibodo, woman not a peace for road. Woman cannot peace for road. Even though you be stranger, you come. If you want to peace, you will see that you will come at that moment. It's not the gods of the land. Why if this why if this say before would they do Ibilo? We go do Ibilo as a feast. Where we go take us, Ajomon, Ajomado. Make them not carry while I come for town. And they no go see problem. Now, why would they do Ibamba? Now they do rest in America because they put us as English. We say no, you carry rest in come. But Ibamba, we they do it before. Sako for where they call Afonta. We go do Ibamba. We go do a uh, feast. Uh, Igwe, you say na uh, evil. Why? Because of uh, church. Okay, God. Not because of say but it's not good to do. Okay, why if we say the tradition our forefathers they use, you know go feed do bad, you know go feed thief, you know go feed four person wife, you know go feed pretend your brother because of money, you know go feed collaborating up your own, you know go feed chop wound, keep uh, the key person, you robot carry wound. Can they come inside our land? Make everybody the chop wound. If you wound they kill you, you go go to the land. They carry your mother go there. The robot go tell you, say, your papa they kill you, your mother they kill you. Say they go uh, kill, kill, kill the wound. Who carry the wound to come? That is why they don't say, now wound you, they kill you. Because they carry the wound to come. Who can be saying, go back, go back to your root? It they make you confused. Why well, you not get sense? You forget, say, go back to your root. I know your bundwa. He he can make a swanny, and he can say we kind of grow legos. I know you about noble. On your phone, you see, my boy came around myself. I have two or three, two or three. On your phone, you hear me. Okay, we're not talking about you. You know, I'm buying you. You 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 see fear me. Can I say? Oh, you put me. Okay, numbu. Okay, okay, numbu. Because we're not like him, we're not like him. We were Unuka. They were our land. Unuka is for just uh, created by human beings. Okay, why is the need for the tradition of Nketuku? Ewaji, Ewaji, Unok, Wana Waji, where the senior man, he made the family, Wana Waji, Wachan Waji, we press over the Ibu, we press over the Ndacha. If, if not, not if not Iwaji for IPOB, by now Iwaji will be foreign affair. Iwaji uh, will be foreign affair. Iwaji, my brother, Iwaji, Iwaji, when my mo, Iwaji, Ibu, Ibu, Jina Pu, Jina Mema, Ino Waliji, Ino Iwaji, Iko Sikini, Ne, Iji respecting the law of the land. Yes, isn't Iwaji German, American? Yeah, Kenya Iwaji. On your corner to them to serve. A brown nooker, a boy, a boy, a boy, a boy, a dear Maguia, a boy, a sea, and water. A snow, 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 a the two in a jaw, while Yako born a jaw, Yako born a jaw, Pocket in a jaw, Yako born a jaw, Kay has the Kajelasting, 
Why get you 300? Why get you 200? On your own now, 50 years, you sort of autona, let us know. On your one, no snowball. On your own, you sort of autona. Thank you very much. Thank you. Well, what are you doing? Where Thank you very much, my brother. As it has said it, so he said, he said, he said. And of course, this is where we draw the curtain for this evening segment. It's simple. Our people must understand. I'm not asking you, come and do. Go and ask your father, why did they do those things they do? It's a simple question. And then maybe you will come back here with a sanitized brain. Of course, the sun will surely rise again. Don't worry. I learned from long ago what matters most in life. And now I think I know why one when people rise against the helpless just for greed the hope it lasts for long but just in dawn of time the sun will rise at last and darkness goes to bed the night may rise and fall but lights will stand out tall some people might believe that one can fight with this Fighting gets tough day, then freedom will not come. In case you want to know what freedom fighting is, then I guess you'll have to go and search real freedom, man. The sun will rise at last, and darkness goes to bed. The night may rise and fall, but light will stand out tall. The sun will rise at last. And darkness goes to bed The dreams of yesterday Will live on in our minds In this our quest we know That men will rise and fall When they try once and fail They'll retreat and succumb a voice from shadows say, Son, heed this wake up call. Strive hard to stand defeat, rise and stand to your feet. Cause the sun will rise at last, and darkness goes to bed. The night may rise and fall, but lights will stand out tall. Yes, the sun has risen, so the dark will have to go. The stars that glitter glow We shine for then you know hey.
announcement, announcement, announcement. The leader of indigenous people of Biafra, Mazin Namde Kanu, declares three days fasting and prayer for IPOB and Biafrans worldwide from Wednesday the 27th to Friday the 29th of May 2020. The duration of the fast is from 6 a.m. to 6 p.m. daily. Praying with the Psalms of David, chapters 1 to 150. The theme, Arise, O Chukwoki Kabiyama, and have mercy upon Biafrans, for the time to favor and restore her. Yea, the set time is now. Psalm 102, verse 13. Day 1. 27th chapter 1 to 50 of Psalm A. Read Psalms chapters 1 to 10. Prayer points. 1. Pray for God's forgiveness and confess the sins of our ancestors. Sins of new generation of Biafrans, like idolatry, ritualism, kidnapping, immorality, wickedness to our brethren, and so on. Two, rededicating our lives to Chukwokika Abiyama by acknowledging that he alone is the God we worship with our children forever. B. Read Psalms chapters 11 to 20. Prayer points. 1. Call upon God to hear our prayers and answer us according to his loving kindness. 2. Pray that God will increase our strength and grace individually and as a people. C. Read Psalms chapters 21 to 30. Prayer points. 1. Renounce and reject every God that we and our ancestors worship. 2. Pray that God will take over the land of Biafra as his dwelling place and cause his glory to manifest in our land. D. Read Psalms chapters 31 to 40. Prayer points 1. Pray that God will remove his judgment from us, Biafrans and take away untimely death from our land. Two, pray that God will restore righteousness into our hearts and cause us to be mindful of his commandments. E, read Psalms chapters 41 to 50. Pray and thank God for answering our prayers. Day 2, 28. Psalms chapters 51 to 100. A. Read Psalms chapters 51 to 60. Prayer points. Pray that God will stop the spread of coronavirus, heal the world, and restore normalcy to the world. Two, pray that God will set up his angels round about the borders of Biafra nation 
and protect our land from invasion by our enemies. B. Read Psalms chapters 61 to 70. Prayer points. 1. Pray that God will roll out all his weapons of war against all enemies who are already in our land, like Fulanis, Amajiris, Boko Harams, Meite Allah, military and paramilitary. 2. Pray that God will restore all the riches he blessed us with and give us peace. C. Read Psalms chapter 71 to 80. Prayer points 1. Pray that God will confound, put our enemies to shame, and execute judgment against Nigeria. 2. Pray that God will revive us and bring back joy to our land. D. Read Psalms chapters 81 to 90. Prayer points 1. Pray for God's protection upon our leader, Mazin Namdekanu, our deputy leader, Mazi Chemefo, members of the directorate, all principal officers. Also, that God will give them wisdom, understanding, and favor to pilot the affairs of IPOB. Two, pray for all IPOB members worldwide that God will protect, bless, and energize us to remain resolute till Biafra is restored. E. Read Psalms chapters 91 to 100 and thank you for answered prayers. Day 3, 29th, Psalms chapters 101 to 150. A. Read Psalms chapters 101 to 110. Prayer points. Pray that God will bring unity amongst all Biafrans, both upland and coastal regions, and increase our love for one another. Two, pray that God will touch the hearts of all saboteurs to change and join the struggle, but punish those who harden their hearts. B, read Psalms. Chapters 111 to 120. Prayer points. 1. Arise, O Chukwoki Kabiyama, and avenge the blood of all Biafran heroes and heroines who died from 1914 to date against Nigeria and her allied nations. 2. Pray and invoke the blood of all fallen heroes to stand before Chukwoki Kabiyama for remembrance. C. Read Psalms chapters 1 to 1 to 130. Prayer points 1. Pray for God to comfort, console, and provide for those who lost their loved ones and send them help from His sanctuary. 2. Pray that God will deliver and set free all IPOB family members who are still incarcerated in various detention camps. Also that God will heal as many of them who are still with wounds. D. Read Psalms chapters 131 to 140. Prayer points 1. O Chukwoki Kabiyama, our Father, Restore our nation, Biafra, this year, according to the multitude of your mercies and according to your promise to us. E. Read Psalms 141 to 150. 
Sing songs of praises to Chukwokike Abiyama, thanking him for deliverance from slavery and death forever, and for Biafra nation independence. Note that one is not limited to the prayer points listed above. They just serve as guides. Pray as the Spirit leads you. At mid night on 29th, there will be candlelight procession on behalf of our fallen heroes. Chukwu Kikabiyama will surely answer our prayers, and all glory returns to him forever and ever. Ise, 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 prepared by evangelist Uza Kumuikike, signed by Mazi Oscar Okeke. Head of IPOB Religious Affairs Committee. Oh man. 